Okay guys, we got new pictures of the SH Figure Arts Jin Kasama from Taken 8. As you guys can see here, obviously the release date, June 2024, we already went over it. The price is 8,000 yen. So, 8,000 yen, according to Yahoo Finance, it says around 55 US dollars. Now, it doesn't look like this is a premium Bandai exclusive, which is great, so there's no 10% to add to it. And if you ask me, he looks great. I mean, I like how he has even more hair separation now. Um, really well sculpted the hair. The face, maybe that's pretty suggestive, you know. Um, I'm not too familiar with... I, I love the Tekken 8 trailers, by the way. I just love them. Uh, but I don't know if I'm too familiar, you know, with Jin enough to say, hey, that's pretty accurate. I mean, the jacket looks really great. You can see how they even went as far as giving it leather textures and then on this part here giving him uh, those other textures to it which is great you have the zippers of course the glove looks pretty good but i have been told that the glove has um something wrong with it which doesn't look correct now like i said not too familiar with the character so i cannot say um but the hoodie looks good man i gotta say you know as a figure looks great the fully articulated figure looks pretty nice of course he has the sh figure arts diaper that that's with all sh figure arts that's kind of like their trademark now you know the sh figure arts diaper you can see how he has old zippers here and straps you can see that the gloves has um the metal Oh man, I, I want to say like ribbons, but maybe, you know, like metal balls or something like that. It's something metal or studs, whatever you want to call them, um, on it, which looks great. And of course, here's the back of the jacket. You can see the wings there, which look great, of course. Remember that we're going to have Devil Genius going to be in the game. And the back legs always, um, with the SH Trigger Arts, they do this where... They have this opening here so the articulation doesn't get messed up but since it's all black since the pants are completely black it doesn't look as bad because it does a good job covering the joint you can still see it obviously but still does a better job than whatever other color uh, you know with other characters they're gonna not gonna look that good but with this one it look good um, the elbows that's another joint that people are gonna complain about because I wish they would have given him like a little like elbow pad like this part here. They would have pushed it a little bit further up. But still, you know, he it, it, it has to be able to move. And of course, the cuts for the butterfly joints. It happens. Um, the little hole here on the boot. I wish they would cover that up. But still, he looks great here. Check that out. That looks pretty darn good the expression of the open mouth so you can hear from the side looking great i mean he's like he's looking great obviously uh, I, you know you're gonna have to deal with <laughs> those holes because of the how the joints are but like i said before if you have if you have purchased any other sh for your arts the same thing is with all of them it's just how they're designed uh, i know they should do better but for right now this is what we're getting you know still this is gonna be an awesome figure to own if you're a fan of tekken you're gonna love it like check out the serious expression here now this thing is a little bit odd is he supposed to have like these white marks here all over the body all over his face because you can see here 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 and he has them in the other pictures is he supposed to have this in this game does that mean like he doesn't have the he, he lost the devil gene is that what they're implying with this but anyway you get three different 
faces, which look great. They look great. And man, I'm pretty sure if you get it, this is gonna be pretty awesome. Now, if you ask me where it's, is the release date gonna be, I say keep an eye out tonight because there is gonna be a lot of pre-orders going up tonight and they haven't specified the pre-order date, but it could be tonight, it could be um, at before the weekend or next week. It, this figure is pretty much, you know, almost, it, it, it's pretty much already uh, ready for to go up for pre-order so you just have to wait find your favorite website ami ami howling in japan ninning whatever it is supposed to be called and just wait just i, I say camping because this is gonna sell pretty darn fast this is gonna sell pretty fast pretty darn fast sadly i won't be able to pick it up because like i said i cut my budget for figures quite a lot this year um unless youtube pick up picks up or you know actual work picks up then i'm probably not gonna spend that much money on figures this year but hey um if i do get some extra cash i'll i'll think about it so we'll have to wait and see so i hope you guys enjoyed the video um please like comment and subscribe for more and i'll see you guys next time